A U.S. Senator, Bob Menendez of New Jersey, who is chairman of the Senate Foreign Relations Committee, which sanctions Zimbabwe was engaged in corruption and bribery in cash and gold bars in Egypt. Menendez and his wife were indicted in New York on federal bribery charges for allegedly accepting hundreds of thousands of dollars in cash, gold bars, a Mercedes-Benz convertible, home mortgage payments, and more in a corrupt relationship with three Garden State businessmen. The three-count indictment unsealed Friday alleges that Menendez provided sensitive U.S. government information and took other steps that secretly aided the government of Egypt and pressured a U.S. Agriculture Department official to protect a business monopoly in Egypt for one of the three businessmen. Prosecutors also accused the 69-year-old Democrat of using his office and influence to disrupt a criminal probe in New Jersey of a second businessman. And they allege that Menendez recommended that President Joe Biden nominate a certain individual as U.S. attorney for New Jersey because the senator believed that person could be influenced by Menendez to disrupt the banking crime prosecution of the third businessman, Fred Dabes, a longtime fundraiser for the senator. This investigation is very much ongoing, said Manhattan U.S. attorney Damian Williams at a press conference on the charges against the senator and his wife, Nadine Menendez, 56 as well as against the three other men, Dabes, Wael Wilhanna, and Jose Uribe. We are not done, Williams said. Menendez, who is up for re-election in 2024, agreed to step down as chairman of the powerful Senate Foreign Relations Committee due to the charges, according to a source close to him who spoke with NBC News. Senate Democratic Caucus rules mandate that members charged with a felony must temporarily cede their chair positions until their case is resolved. A senior Senate source told World News 247 that Senator Ben Cardin, Democrat Maryland, will take over as chairman of the Foreign Relations Committee. As Foreign Relations Chairman, Menendez had influence over the executive branch's decisions to provide military sales and aid to Egypt. He was appointed to his Senate seat in January 2006 by then New Jersey Governor John Corzine, who had vacated that seat after being elected governor. Menendez was elected to the seat later that year, and since then has twice won re-election as New Jersey's senior senator. Menendez married Nadine, whose maiden name is Arslanian, in October 2020 after dating for just under three years. She was for many years a friend of Hannah, a 40-year-old native of Egypt, according to the indictment. The indictment says that after she began dating Menendez, she and Hannah introduced the senator to Egyptian intelligence and military officials for the purpose of establishing and solidifying a corrupt agreement to bribe him and Nadine to benefit Egypt with military sales and financing. Menendez, Nadine, and the other defendants are due to appear Wednesday morning in Manhattan Federal Court. The indictment says that during a June 2022 raid on the Menendez's New Jersey home and a safe deposit box, federal agents found cash, gold and a luxury vehicle that were the fruits of, the couple's, corrupt bribery agreement with the businessman. Over $480,000 in cash much of it stuffed into envelopes and hidden in clothing. Closets and a safe was discovered in the home, along with over $70,000 in Nadine Menendez's safe deposit box, the indictment said. Some of the envelopes contained the fingerprints and or DNA of the 66-year-old Dabes or his driver. In addition to the cash, agents also seized 81.5 ounces of gold bars. At the current spot price, those bars are worth about $155. Federal prosecutors are seeking the forfeiture of those items, as well as the residents of the Menendezes in Englewood Cliffs.